just Marty just stares into your soul. Got the whole crew here. I am not a camper. It's never been my thing. I mean, I've done it before, obviously, but I find it hard to get excited about sleeping in the woods if I have no reason to be there. But after getting the Honda and the Grizzly, I want to go places. The biggest problem is hotels. On our trip to Niagara Falls, we paid $500 for two nights, and that was the cheapest room I could find. I tried to avoid it as long as I could, but the solution was very obvious. I may not like it, but I now had a reason to go camping. Before I can plan my next trip, I need to figure out if my love for adventures outweigh my dislike of sleeping outside. Since I had a buddy coming down from New York City, I knew that this would be the perfect weekend to try camping on the farm. <laughs> Again, I'm not a camper, but Sammy loves it. He goes all the time with the kids. He has a ton of camping gear and was more than happy to join us for this weekend. And I'm glad he did, because I was not ready for how much stuff we had to bring. We had the entire truck loaded before I knew it. Looking good, man. Props. <laughs> yeah. Professional. Safety first, people. Safety first. Ready to do this? Yeah, we yep. have. Marty just stares into your soul. Right, we have all the camping essentials, hot dogs, burgers, some brats. Big guys. The big ones? Big guys. But they also make ones that have uh, chocolate. I think that's too big, dude. <laughs> that's not too big. There's no such thing as too big. Oh, well, it's when you're trying to stuff it in your mouth, it is too big. <laughs> you are not a chubby bunny, my friend. <laughs> Got the whole crew here. Somehow we beat them down here on the blue machine, but I think they took the scenic route. Who's this? Yeah, no, that's Lucas's machine. That water's like gonna feel really cold. Look at the fish. <laughs> Is it warm or cold? It's not bad. It's it's cool but refreshing.
Are you just gonna plug one of your ears? <laughs> well, I can't plug both of them. Hey! In case anyone's ever wondering, yes, you can. So this one, fold it around, okay. pull it back, lock it, string comes down, you uh, release the clip, oh, fold it. Oh, folds that way, okay. And then you get your sight. Oh, I guess it's a red dot. Yeah, it's not working. Holy cow, this one's working, dude. I haven't used this red dot in... Hollow Sun, for real though, this has a solar charger on the front. <laughs> it's a good sight. Oh, and dude, check this out. Big old clip, look at that. Do you have rounds. ammo for that? 30 rounds. Do you have any ammo for it? Yeah, I brought some ammo for it. I nice. rock on. That's really satisfying. <laughs> oh, you're out. <laughs> That's a souvenir. Souvenir to take back with you to New York. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try to hit your cans with uh, an iron. The, the red dot's not working. Yeah, no, the red dot's not working. Nope. Sorry, get red behind dot. you. Nope. Nope. Sam, you want to load the big gun? Nope. Yeah, for a minute. Uh, nope. Your handgun. Remember, folks, gun safety. That was twice. Look what I found. What is that? It's a bullet. That is cool. Hog, if you want to keep that one, you can say you shot it. Thanks. Anyway, you guys hungry? You guys ready yeah, to eat? Yeah. Cool. Let's make some food. Oh, wow. All right, looks like we're just about ready. And here is our selection of fine meats for this evening. Mmm, yeah, those are looking real good. The good burgers, the normal ones, <laughs> that that one burger. There's always the one, you know? One of those bird scooters, but they have racks and bikes everywhere. So dinner was great. Now we're gonna go back down, maybe do some more riding, set up the bonfire. Hey, sissy! How you doing? Hey. What, how did you guys get down here? Like, where did Ben go? Where'd Ben go? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I love this pocket though. I, I, I got so much scrap in here. I got my guns, I got two bottles of water, and I could probably fit like six bottles of water in there. Dude, I love ATV so much. Dude, they're sick. They're just so much fun. So far, this all has been great. It's been a fun day. But I don't need to camp to do any of this. The real question was, how did I get into camping? And to answer that, you have to see what happens next. After we did everything we had planned to do, we sat and watched the stars. Minutes turned to hours. With all the distractions gone and the phones off and the stars out, I began to see it. I began to understand the magic of camping. Why Sam loved it and so many people did it. But as amazing as that night was, it was the morning that finally won me over.
you're gonna see the uh, the mist is rising off the water. And the surface is smooth as glass. It's just really nice. Dude, I love this so much. I didn't think I would as much because I've always hated camping, but last night was amazing. It was great. I'm, uh, I'm gonna do this more often. I just, I just really like this. This is nice. The sun is just about to come up. The so camp is way down there. And I moved up to the top of the hill. Well, I want to see the sunrise. This was worth it. I'd go camping for this. I thought that I had nothing to do, but that's the point. Sometimes it's good to just have nothing to do. Thanks for watching, guys.